So on today's episode, you might have saw the short form video yesterday, but today we are talking about Nikolai Jokic rookie cards. But uh, before that, you can see that I'm rocking a tag shirt. I have no sponsorships at all on this channel. Absolutely none. No one's putting money in my pocket. All I'm doing is doing what I like to do. I love cards. I love video editing. I love picture editing. I'm mixing. I'm blending them all. So enjoy it while I'm here because more than likely I am not going to be here forever. So if you guys want to throw me some free merch, if you guys want to throw me some shirts, a Zion case or something, y'all let me know. I'm down to promote your product. I don't care. Uh, I'm just having a good time. So if you guys want to put some clothes on me, uh, Jeremy from, uh, from Tag Grading, uh, Sports Card Live. The quality of the shirt is amazing. Like, it's not cheap. It's great. Like, I, I love the feel. Like, I've worn this on multiple occasions, and uh, it's just a great, great shirt that you guys got here. So, uh, I haven't tried your guys' slabs yet, but uh, maybe one day I will. Uh, but to get to the video, this Nikolai Jokic Silver Prism card was once only a $350 card. Now it's selling for around twenty six, twenty five hundred. It peaked at six thousand. Will they make a championship run? Out of the three cards that you see right here, the most important one is the silver prism. But as you see on the graph up there, there's kind of a big gap of just they're not as close as they used to be in pricing. And if there's going to be one that rises, it's either going to, I think it's going to be the red, white, and blue because the red, white, and blue always trails the silver. It's a very low population. It's a, so just to give you a little juice, a little context before I say uh, these words, retail, the definition of retail for sports cards is something that you can find the product inside of Walmart target myers um other stores in the any really cvs walgreens you can find sports cards in those stores um you can only get this red white and blue from retail products i think it's the cello pack if i'm i i might be wrong for that year but i believe it's the cello pack um and that's you can only hit that in retail so I think it's actually a little bit rarer than the silver and a, and it's a lot rarer than the base card. Base card, you could get it from re retail, which we just went over the definition of retail. But let's go over the definition of hobby really quick. Hobby products are definitely the more pricey products, but they also give you the best possibility of getting the bigger cards, bigger, depending on what you're looking for. In a collector like myself, I don't really open anything. I just get the cards that I want either in trade or doing what I need to do, get the cards. You know what I mean? Um, but the, how can I say this? The people that buy sports cards typically stick to hobby products because you can get more autographs, different variations and different color, more expensive cards. The boxes are definitely more expensive though. So you need to keep that in mind. I do not think that it is worth ripping retail at all there's very very select few products that are worth it but if you want to know that information you have to subscribe there's no other way because i'm not giving you all the info right now you need to subscribe tune in for more information because i'm here to help and that's all i'm trying to do so subscribe leave me a like comment if you have any questions with this stuff this these card, this card thing is very complex and complicated. So if, if I can iron out any details for you, I would be more than happy to. So if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe again. This Nikolai Jokic rookie card, all of them could fall. This could be peak pricing with uh, Nikolai Jokic, Nikola Jokic rookie cards. Uh, this could be the absolute peak. They could get, they could lose this series to Suns even though they're up three to two they just need one more game and the game's tonight to close it out they just need one more game tonight to close it out but you never know and they still have to go through the western conference finals whether it be the warriors or the lakers i personally think it's going to be the warriors um 
taking the Lakers in seven because Anthony Davis is out. I might be wrong. I'm more than likely going to be wrong because I usually am, but we'll see what happens. Uh, just be aware that Nikola Jokic rookie cards are at their abs. They're not at their absolute peak, but they're still high comparatively to what they have been in the past. The silver prism was once $350. The base PSA 10 was once $18 and 50 cents. And the red, white, and blue was $55 from what I remember back in 2017. So you have to keep that in mind. These cards still have room to fall, especially if they don't win. If they don't win and his prices go up, there is some funny business going on. So don't let people lie to your face because this industry is full of sharks and liars. So you have to be careful. I'm here to help you. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave it down in the comment section below. I also do consultations for $100. So if you want to give me a phone call, give me a FaceTime call, it is only $100. So please contact me if you need that to talk about cards and maybe build a little, a little uh, collection plan. Uh, so have a great day. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye. Yo, what the fuck? Subscribe to my channel already.